Yeah, no, nobody's going for the unhook yet. That one girl just healed with the boon totem. I'm cool with her going. Oh my, <laughs> dude, it reactivated right under her feet. <laughs> oh, you can't make it up. Oi, oi, oi. Dead by Daylight players. It's good to see you guys. Welcome back to the greenhouse, of course. Thank you guys for being here. Uh, I hope you've unclenched your jaw. Today we're playing as the Trapper Man, who traditionally, when it comes to Trapper, has been kind of an M1 killer. He's needed a buff for a long time, and he finally got it. Uh, Trapper and the PTB can now carry two uh, traps the minute he spawns into a match, which does cut down a little bit on you having to place a trap, go somewhere else, pick up a trap, and then place that. It saves you a good 30 seconds at the beginning of the game, if not a little bit more in some cases, but he also has an add-on pass, and oh my god, the Trapper sack got changed. All bear traps are carried at the beginning of the trial instead of spawning on the map. Bear traps cannot be picked up. So now, Trapper starts with six traps all of the time if you use this add-on, but you can never pick them up, which means you need to be very, very smart about where you place them and get constant value out of them. Now, if we take that and combine it with the dreaded iridescent stone every 30 seconds one closed bear trap chosen at random becomes set well then you have a recipe for absolute chaos okay and hey for the memes we even threw on this build right we even threw on bloodhound so that when somebody's bleeding we could just track them a little bit better especially if they're running uh shadow step so without further ado let's dive right in get your water unclenched your jaw it's gonna be a doozy of a video and of course subscribe to the channel all right <clears throat> We are at the Grim Pantry. I cannot, can we talk about, I can't wait for this map to just get reworked. I don't hate it. I just, it, it, it just feels dated in comparison to literally everything. So we're going to try to hard counter all of the survivor. Uh, we're going to place this a little off-centered, actually. Um, we're going to try to hard counter uh, the new perks, the boon totems. And in doing so, we're going to trap up our own totem so that it forever remains great. Now, what we're running is we have the add-on here, the, the bag. Yeah. Uh, we have the capability uh, to carry all of our traps at the very beginning of the match. But while we carry all of our traps, they can never be picked back up. So I have my three gen and I know what I want. We have Bloodhounds so that if they are running something that is going to um, allow them to... Do we have Deadheart? There we go. We have Bloodhounds so that if they do end up running through uh, one of their boon totems, right? Like Shadow uh, Shadow Step. I'll be able to see their blood so that I don't really need to rely on Scratch Mark so much. Oh my god, we got him. We're also using Retribution and Undying, which is super interesting now, because Undying allows you to see the auras of anyone near uh, your your dull totems, right? And then Retribution lets you know if anybody... Uh, basically, people that are on those dull totems are now oblivious. So if somebody is working on a dull totem, right, like, you kind of just get to know about it ahead of time, which feels super good, you know? Um, and then they're oblivious. They can't tell. So it kind of, you know, if somebody wants to bless a dull totem, they, they are going to have to work for it. Is that for the people? Wait. Oh, no. You got yourself out of a trap, didn't you? Oh, my God. This is not going well for you guys. This is... Oh, she DC'd. Stepped in a trap, broke her mama's back so hard that she fell and unplugged her fucking Ethernet cable. That girl was scared to go through the pallet. Did she drop down? Okay. I'm going to loop her. Is she going to camp that, you think? Yeah, watch it. Watch it. <laughs> Yo, being gigabrained really has its benefit. She tried to heal, so that automatically gets rid of her D-strike. So that's kind of fun. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, no, that's good. You could, yeah, we could try that. That's okay. Oh my gosh, look at the blood. She gave me she gave me the dumpy right there. There we go. She she did step inside the boon there, but I could absolutely see her. I mean, she didn't go far enough for me to be like, oh, where'd she go? I feel like these add-ons are gonna be super, super like for the crack trappers who just want to start out and not waste a bunch of time. Like it's these are gonna be insane. 
Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> PTV is on one. This is this I talk about this all the time, but at, at PTB you can't really gather reliable data in PTB because you're not playing against the best of the best, right? So you know, I, I think a lot of us panic about like, ah, oh, boon totems and all that. It, it's gonna be really hard to see how they really affect like actual matches until we see people playing in act because like this this stuff happens. These matches disappear so fast that like what are you supposed to do, you know? Oh my god. Dude, they, they never, they absolutely never had a fucking chance. <laughs> absolutely never. Never, never, ever. Oh my lanta. Okay. Alright. Oh my god. Alright. Snuff that out. Uh, place, oh, how, how close, there we go. Place a trap in front of it. What's crazy is the traps auto open after 30 seconds. Any trap that's been set it auto auto opens back up because the eerie stone. And so anything I set, yeah, while it is permanent, it basically like they're locked out of every loop like it, permanently. It's absolutely nasty. It's absolutely nasty. Oh, she didn't want to play. <laughs> she, she didn't want to play. Now I just have a trap stuck in the corner forever. <laughs> All right, what do we got, Nia? Oh, she's is she gonna go upstairs? Yeah, you should do that. Yeah, you should definitely do that. That would be. <laughs> oh, next level, Nia. That's what we're gonna call her from now on. What a fucking, what a fucking Aphrodite amongst women. Now this isn't the way. <laughs> oh no, that's also incredibly rough. <laughs> she DC'd. <laughs> okay. All right, the Sanctum. Uh, let's hope we don't have like. Uh, I I really want to like put Trapper through his paces with these add-ons. It that is super hard to do, um, with people kind of always sort of dying on hook and stuff or, or just. So I'm hoping we can sort of prevent that. Gee, those two gens are so close together. I feel like I gotta lock that up a little bit. I feel like, oh man, what would be a good trap? That window is unlikely to be great. I think let's just lock the pallet up. A lot of these traps are gonna be kind of sort of obvious, but if we could just lock up like short parts of loops, then no ish. So I think to be real cheeky, We'll place one here, because you really aren't going to be around this side unless you... Like, I, I want the pallet to appear safe, but because it's in the corner, I'm, I'm cool with, like, not locking the pallet, per se. This is a little risky, because you can't pick these traps up once you set them. Uh, one thing I do want to set, I don't want anyone vaulting here. Uh, so we're just going to set this trap, like, right here. But I want anybody that's going to, like, go down and around so to also get trapped up. This, is, this feels like an actual trapper match, like taking a lot of time to set up, but that's primarily because they're not doing anything, question mark? Oh, this is the noise notification. Well, welcome to the game. There is a boon totem somewhere. Oops, okay, it's up there. It's in the middle. All right, cool. Oh, hello? Oh, I couldn't pick her up for a second. That's good. Okay. I'm not going to crush that boon because I'm not super scared of it. I'm going to let her stay in that trap. That just means that she's tied up and can't do anything. Is she going to leave? Oh, she is going to leave. She's going to sprint burst. Okay. So throw it. All right, that makes sense. Okay, so I kind of, there was somebody here, one person got caught on the trap, and then one person here. Whoa, okay. I was like, that's a boon toad? Like, I was very confused. I thought that was a boon. No, it's just the entity whispering sweet nothings to me. All right, four people injured. Yeah, n nobody's going for the unhook yet. That one girl just healed with the boon totem. Cool with her going. 
Oh my, <laughs> dude, it reactivated right under her feet. <laughs> oh, you can't make it up. Oh my God. <laughs> right under her feet, it just sprung to life. Oh my God, that's gotta, that's gotta be rough. All right, we're gonna go ahead and bust these up a little bit. Wow. Wow, wow, the timing. That is incredible. <laughs> All right, there's the unhook there. Uh, they snapped that one. Little do they know it will be back. If they snapped it, they probably went to the right. Yeah. Hey, what's up, new friend? It's always like a cocky play to be like, oh, I'm gonna work on the, I'm gonna work on the jet now. I just have to waste. I mean, 30 seconds is a lot of time to waste here, so I don't know that I'm gonna get 30 seconds of value, but. Oh, 99 Sprint Burst, all right. Let me 99 my Sprint Burst, hold on. We got a, we got a decent survivor here, like I'm into it. All right, so she, I think she thinks that that window is locked up. So I think she's gonna try to. Yes, dude, let's go. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. When you can make this thing work. Yeah. I'm into that. I don't think they realize that it, that, like, what add on I'm using. I don't think they have any idea. There we go. She'll hit that vault. Yeah, there she goes. She'll go. She'll probably just run straight. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Cool. So, that'll reactivate. They see that that's trapped up. Okay. Oh, my, my Lanta. See, the good news is, like, even if the trap doesn't snap with this add-on, the, the thing you have to kind of consider is that it still is, like, an insane deterrent. Like, people still don't want to mess with it. Oh, wow. Okay. That was pretty good. Yeah, there it is. Let's go, dude. The the traps. Yeah, this is this is like the trapper combo that makes him pretty nutty. Oh, please open. Please open. I'm going to try to go around. I'm going to try to get her to play around it a few times so it'll open back up. Just We're just going to dance for a second. How long do you think? <laughs> That's good. That's good. That's good. Good soup. All right. Uh, somebody hopped on that one, but this one has more progress. Let me check it. Yeah, this is what I thought. So this one's got more progress. I'm going to go ahead and bop it real quick. Cool beans. I said cool beans. Dad mode engage. <laughs> Oh, I'm surprised you didn't go for the unhook, actually. Like, I expected a full farm right there. Fucking Farmville. Um, okay. All right, we'll go ahead and take this opportunity. We'll snuff this totem out, and then we'll just go back. Oh, wow. She actually is wrapping around the building, just not paying any attention. You still make noise. If you had Iron Will, that would be really, really good, but you still make noise. You're not invisible. Oh, man. They almost got this one done. <laughs> I hear somebody. I hear him. I hear him. Ooh. Yeah, I'm not going to go for her. That's okay. That's my obsession. So we got this one. We got this one up here. I think we're going to go ahead and lock this up. We still are hanging on to a few traps. So There's a boon right here. Pretty obvious. And then there's a crow right here that just flew down, so. Honestly worth a check, you know? Is that person dying on hook? No way. All right, I'll go and bop this. Are they too busy running across the map to the other boon to heal? Oh my god, I think that's exactly what just happened. They just sort of let her die. Okay. GG easy, I suppose. 
Play with your food, giving me that sweet speed boost. I'm just able to get around faster. That blast mine was very smart. Very smart play. Okay, another boon was set up somewhere. It may honestly be at the top again up here. Nope, it, it's not. You know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm going to just, like, trap. <laughs> I think I'm just going to trap it. There's a crow again. Yeah, there we go. I think I'll chase away for this one. Okay, there's somebody in that corner. Yeah. Let's see what she's got. Ooh, the first dead heart I've seen in a long time. Hey, that was really good. That was a really solid dead heart. I suspect two gens will probably get done. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Ooh. You had to take the random vault, didn't you? Come here. Yeah, they don't have enough time to get that one done. Oh, wow. This girl is just... She's running. Oh. Why'd she fake the vault? She could have just vaulted. I don't know why she faked it. That was weird. I mean, either way, I think she was done. But uh, that was a choice. It was certainly a choice. Honestly, considering everything, they still did very good. I wouldn't say these add-ons are broken or OP, but they definitely like make Trapper very serviceable. Which is kind of maybe a testament to Trapper. Like, obviously, I didn't bring any slowdown. So if I brought Ruin and Pop and stuff like that, it'd be a very different match. But kind of interesting that I could bring these add-ons and still have, like, a close game. It's very, very interesting. Very, very interesting. And there you have it, the new and improved Trapper that has the Trapper Sack and the Iridescent Stone. Super fun add-ons thrown in combination. Doesn't feel like OP or broken. Um, super enjoyable. Of course, we, you know, we throw the Blood Hat on in case, you know, they, they're using the Shadow Step. And obviously, you could run Slow Down, Sloppy Butcher and stuff like that if you think they're going to heal and things like that. So, um, but yeah, super, super fun. Uh, really enjoyed it. Hope you guys enjoy this when it hits live servers. Uh, don't forget to hit subscribe on the channel, of course. Get your water for the day. And I'll be pretty into the entity to see you in the uh, next video.